Hey everybody, it's Christine at Everyday Rustics. It's my midnight face. Well, not really midnight, but it's late at night. I am setting up my barcode scanner and I looked all over line for tutorials. Tutorials, again, I'm doing this is like my second time recording this, but tutorials on how to set up this barcode scanner for my uh, Square POS. So, see, we have the Square POS, there's the barcode scanner big mystery so if you're like me and you like to do it yourself you don't want to outsource anything because you're a teeny tiny business and you're trying to save a little bit of overhead well let me help you um get some more rest tonight let's let's go ahead and make this quick and easy for you because you know tomorrow's a new day and money 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 let's make some money um now i connected my scanner to my POS system. Um, in the quick start guide, it's the symbol, I guess I should mention the, the brand, it's symbol um, LS2208. So in the quick start guide, there's a barcode scanner for the um, set factory defaults. I scanned that. Don't know if you have to, but I did, so let's just do my steps. So hook up the barcode scanner, scan that quick and easy let's walk you over to my computer so now at my computer I generated a barcode um, for the SKU that I entered into my um, square um, and I went to rugged tablet PC right there dot com I typed in my SKU that's in my uh, square uh, for my Teflon sheets and then it and then I hit generate barcode image it generated the barcode image I downloaded it it pulled it up in another tab I right clicked I saved the image it saved to my download file I opened up my word just so I could print it real quick and test it out and it really did work so let's go back over to the square stand so I brought it back over here and remember like I said on the square stand you want to go to items my Teflon sheet and then right here where the skew is supposed to be I typed in the same skew that's on here now watch the magic how simple this is those were the only steps so this is where I, I had scanned it before to test it out it's already up there but let's scan it again because it's magic see and so it updated it with another Teflon sheet and that is how you set up your barcode scanner so step one you are going to connect your barcode scanner to your square scan. Step two, you are going to possibly scan that um, set factory default barcode scanner thingy. Yes, I know, I looked down and I cheated because it's so late at night. Um, step three, you are going to create your SKU, uh, SKU number or SKU, whatever you want. In my case, it's SKU letters. Um, on your POS in your square store and then step four you're going to take that SKU go to the website um, to generate a free barcode type that in um, click generate save that image and just put it in Word, Excel, Illustrator whatever you want to do and then step five finally step five scan and it will automatically add it to checkout. And that is how you set up your barcode scanner uh, or the symbol LS2208. Um, so for all of those people out there who had these long-winded tutorials, wow, right. So those of you who are watching who really needed this tutorial, get some sleep. I feel you. I really do. Like, 
minimum makeup tonight. I'm working real late. I got my whole family in here. My husband's asleep. You can also stop the video right now and go and make those barcodes. I'm just going to keep rambling and shaking my head because I'm still in disbelief on how hard it was to find a tutorial or to piece everything together to connect the scanner when it was so simple. It's like derivatives and calculus. Yeah, let's not even take it there. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great night. God bless and uh, make some money.